Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Gramps. Wisdom is the final frontier in gaining true knowledge. Our mission is to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friend. This is Gramps. Thanks for coming along on our journey to increase wisdom and create a living legacy. Today is day 1,575 of our trek, and it's time for another snippet of wisdom, which includes an inspirational quote, along with some wise words from Gramps for today's trek. If you apply the words that you hear today, over time, it will help you to become healthy, wealthy, and wise as you continue on your daily trek of life. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. Today's quote is from Ralph Waldo Emerson, and it is... The wise man in the storms prays to God, not for safety from danger, but for deliverance from fear. It is the storm within which endangers him, not the storm without. So today's snippet will be the storm within. None of us desire to go through hardship and difficulties. Our first instinct is to cry out to God to be kept safe and to be rescued from the storm. What we fail to realize, just like the storms in nature have a cleansing purpose, so do the storms that roll through our lives. When we are in the midst of the storm, we become fearful and wish for the storm to cease. However, we need the strength to withstand the storm and peace within the storm. This is only possible when we are entirely reliant on the one who controls all storms. The most significant potential for harm from storms of our lives is when we allow fears to seize us and to hold us. The internal storms in which we struggle is what endangers us. Like the wind and the rain that cleans the air and refreshes the soil, the wind and the showers within us have a cleansing effect on our souls. So be a wise person. The next time you are in one of the many storms of life, instead of praying for safety from danger and the effects of the storm, Pray instead for the deliverance from fear so you can persevere through the storm. Once the storm has passed, it is then you will see clearly its purpose as the bright sunshine of God's love warms your soul. Let's look at a couple verses for today. Proverbs chapter 10 verse 25. When the storms of life come, the wicked are whirled away, but the godly have a lasting foundation. And Romans chapter 8 verses 38 and 39. I am convinced that nothing can separate us from God's love, neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither fears for today nor worries about tomorrow. Not even the powers of hell can separate us from God's love. No power in the sky above or in the earth below. Indeed, nothing in all creation will ever be able to separate us from the love of God that is revealed in Christ Jesus our Lord. As you ponder this nugget of wisdom for yourself today, please encourage your friends and family to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you'd like to listen to in the past 1,574 treks or read the wisdom journals, they are all available at wisdom-trek.com. And I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on your favorite podcast player so that each day's trek will be downloaded to you automatically. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend, as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek Podcast and Journal each day. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you tomorrow for Worldview Wednesday.